Now I'm going to show you how to add to a selection in Adobe Photoshop. If you've not already done so, please subscribe to the Help Video Guru channel on YouTube. Now here we have two very simple objects, uh, simple to make this tutorial as basic and fast as possible. And at this moment I have the circle selected. Now if I want to add the triangle, as a selection, or to this selection, I should say, without unselecting the circle. What I need to do is hold down the Shift key before I begin creating my new selection. Now, to create my new selection of the triangle, uh, I'm going to go to the third tool down on the toolbar, click and hold, and select the polygonal lasso. Now, remembering to hold down Shift, I click on one corner of the triangle. Now, because the way this polygonal lasso tool works is it just follows the dots that I place by clicking. I can simply click each corner in succession and then return to the original corner and click once more to close the new portion of the selection and now you can see I have both the circle and the triangle selected. Now if I wanted to remove part of the selection I can hold down the ALT key so if I go to the second item down and click and hold I have my basic selection. Uh, here I'm going to choose elliptical marquee tool. Now I'm going to go into the circle holding down the alt key. I'm going to click and drag and you'll see that I've now made a cutout in the center of the circle. And to show you how that works I'm going to go edit, copy and then edit paste and what that's going to do is copy and paste the selection that I had into a new layer in the document. Now if we go to our layers palette on the right hand side here our original background if we click on that and click on the eye just to the left we'll make that background invisible and what we'll be left with is layer 1 which is the pasted layer and which shows the selection that I pasted down that includes the hole in the middle of the circle and the additional triangle that I added to the original circular selection. Please see my other videos for more help and tutorials. If you found this video tutorial useful, please subscribe to Help Video Guru on YouTube for updates and new info.